Okay, so here we go. This is going to be a video about installing R and then R Studio. First, let's find some links to get us to the uh, get us to download R and R Studio. I'm going to do that by starting at Blackboard. Just remind you that all content for this course is going to be kept up on my website. So here we go. We're just going to go find my website from within Blackboard. Go find the syllabus from under the meta section. And in it, there's going to be some links to R and R Studio down here in the additional requirements section of the syllabus. So let's start in order. We're just going to click the link to R, go to download R. It's easiest to pick a cloud near you since uh, I am in California right now. I'm going to pick the cloud, uh, the mirror from Oregon. If you happen to be in Taiwan, Check it out. The National Taiwan University set up their own mirror. If you're in Taiwan, click the one in Taiwan. If you're in California, click the one from Oregon. If you're in Uruguay, click the one from Uruguay. Pick the one closest to you. Save people some bandwidth. Once you're here, I am on a Mac, so I will click Download for Mac. And you will want this R package right here, 4.0.3. Uh, click that, download it, and install it on your own machine. If you're on a Windows machine, I recommend you click R for Windows, if that makes sense, and then go over here, install R for the first time. And that will give you an executable that will install R for you. Okay, so there's really nothing much to that. I'm not going to walk you through doing that, uh, doing the installation. If you need some help with that, you have all week to get this done. Um, you can come check me out in office hours for any help you need there. Let's go back to the syllabus, and next, after downloading and installing R, we'll go to R Studio. Down here on the R Studio page, we're going to look for R Studio Desktop. We absolutely want the free version, so you'll click download for R Studio Desktop free. Please install that next. In another video, I will show you how to use R and R Studio. This one is just about installing them. So I'll trust that after you download these things, you all can install them on your own.